Hi, this is Gilles, Radio Prepper, arriving here at La Madone du Tel, a beautiful place, which, as the story goes, in 580 AD, the Virgin Mary appeared to a bunch of uh, Spanish sailors caught in a violent storm, saved them and pointed them to this place, where they built a small oratory, uh, which later became a chapel. Uh, you'll see that uh, my friends are already there, I'm the last one to arrive. <laughs> Patrick is uh, directing me uh, to park. By the way, I'm having some microphone trouble in this video and I still have to figure that one out, so uh, my apologies for that. Uh, you can see that uh, Frederick, the ceiling uh, is already operating and uh, in the half dome tent on the left, uh, Xavier is already set up too. So this is the uh, famous uh, Madone uh, Dutel. And you can see the view around here, it's just spectacular. We're at about 1300 meters. And there is some sort of a plateau here and we're set up uh, right over there. You know what? I'm gonna show it to you from the air. FPV drone view.
and here is our radio camp. Of course, I got here last as usual. <laughs> but it's time for a little uh, aperitif, uh, you know, drinks and food. So that's how you start a uh, field operation, right? Well, this doesn't look too good, especially for the uh, Delta Loop, which doesn't quite look like a triangle. But I'm trying my new uh, 2 to 1 uh, ballon. Some say it's a 4 to 1, but I measured it at 2 to 1, so who knows. But uh, I have a 20, well, I have a 10 meter wire for the 20 meter band going down here. Oh, nice view. And here I have my new giant transformer, which is uh, made with a, an FT240 43. It's a 64 to 1, 3 ton primary. 24 turn store all. So pretty uh, simple setup today with uh, the uh, VRM5080 on 6 meter FM uh, that's uh, made by Rakal by the way and uh, it's powered by a LiPo um, I think it's a yeah, 7S LiPo 5 amp hours and I have my uh, Xigu G1M which I'm going to use on 20 meters I have my Kent key for CW and an electret microphone also <laughs> I'm monitoring the local repeaters well not so local but uh, 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 Mount Agile and uh, the um, uh, Mount Chauve uh, <laughs> Bold Mountain basically uh, TG2806 uh, uh, Ici Gilles ici donc uh, je suis uh, à la Madone du Tel, la Madone du Tel, donc à 1300 mètres d'altitude. Et donc j'ai installé mon VRM 5080 là avec la Delta Loop. Hein. Et bien, euh, ben ça marche. Hein. <rire> Comment est mon signal, euh, Roland Foxtrot for Whiskey, Bravo, Yankee. Foxtrot for India, Bravo, Yankee. Thank you, 5958. Whiskey, Bravo, Yankee. Whiskey, Bravo, Yankee. Thank you very much. Uh, okay, Foxtrot for Whiskey, Bravo, Yankee. Your 5958. Thank you very much. Your 5858 in the south of France. Over. You are how much? Oh, uh, your number is uh, how much? Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, Oh, sorry, I didn't know you were in a contest. Uh, sorry about that. Okay, thank you. Good luck. Good luck. Thank you, thank you. Well, contest, uh, so... Uh, oh, well. All right, so there is a contest on 20 meters, and uh, unfortunately, I don't think I'm going to find anyone to uh, help me compare my transformers here to, uh, to see which one works better, so... Uh, although I can go on uh, the uh, CW portion of the band and make a few calls and see if the same station will report me with a different uh, uh, noise, uh, you know, to signal to noise ratio. So that might be a way to go. Uh, I could try digital modes and whisper mode, but uh, that's a bit of a, yeah, it's a longer setup. So I'm going to try in CW maybe, but I might have some problem with my paddle so I'm not sure uh, we'll see Foxtrot for whiskey Bravo Yankee Foxtrot for whiskey Bravo Yankee Thank you. 
Oscar Zulu 8 uh, Charlie Tango Hotel. Yes, this is Foxtrot for Whiskey Bravo Yankee. I repeat, uh, Whiskey Bravo Yankee. You are 5656 five, here in the south of France uh, on a mountaintop at uh, 1300, uh, yeah, about 1100 meters. 1100 meters uh, operating uh, QRP portable QSL. Uh, QSL for 5252, 52, thank you very much. If you don't mind, I'm uh, testing uh, different uh, transformers for my uh, unfed antenna. I would like to switch to another transformer. If you give me 30 seconds and maybe compare the two antennas if you don't mind, uh, QSL. Thank you very much uh, for the contact. Uh, sorry we couldn't do the test uh, for uh, the different antenna, but uh, thank you very much again. You have a great weekend and uh, 73 from uh, Foxtrot 4. Whiskey, bravo, Yankee, back to you. Uh, ah oui, Phil, ok, bien reçu. Hein. Bien reçu, merci beaucoup. Hein. Je vais changer d'antenne pour voir si ça, euh, éventuellement, ça passerait mieux avec une antenne euh, omnidirectionnelle, hein, euh, alimentée au bout. Hein, Peut-être euh, juste pour voir si, euh, si ça passerait mieux. Hein, QSL All right, I'm going to switch antennas and uh, I'm going to uh, put my uh, unfed half wave instead of the delta loop and we'll see if Phil uh, gets me better. Of course, the antenna could have the wrong orientation, so who knows, but uh, I'll try the uh, unfed half wave with the 61 um, uh, material core and we'll see how that works. Okay, I reduced the size of the antenna, reduced the wire a little bit. Didn't get a very good SWR with the uh, 61 core, I don't know why, but let's try to call Phil again and see uh, if he hears me better. Attention, Phil, uh, Phil. Uh, F4 India Victor Yankee pour F4 Whisky Bravo Yankee. All right, so uh, yeah, he got it. I told him that uh, I was going to go back on the, the uh, Delta Loop, the unfed half wave. Meh. You know, SWR is not very good uh, with the uh, with the score. So, uh, 49 to 1, 61 core, nah, not that great. But the fact is, uh, using a torrid fed uh, and fed half wave on VHF is not a good idea. <laughs> and that's just the way it is, guys. Uh, it's good up to uh, maybe uh, 10 meters, 11 meters, you know. But higher than that it's not made for that and uh, don't use a torrid to uh, to make a unfed halfway for six meters it's just not going to work uh, so there are other ways to uh, to make unfed half waves uh, on six meters but uh, using a torrid uh, transformer is just not the way to go propagation has totally disappeared on 20 meters so there's no point in trying to test uh, any further on 20 meters <laughs> it's not gonna work and uh, so I'm going to uh, string up my uh, 80 meter antenna my 40 meter wire and uh, hopefully that will work and uh, we'll do some uh, NVIS Et là j'avais une petite pensée, donc j'espère que tu as pas trop de pluie là-haut, je sais pas. F4 Whisky, bravo Yankee, F6HB. Alors pour l'instant, euh, alors non, on n'a pas de pluie, hein. euh, par contre on est dans les nuages, c'est-à-dire qu'on n'a pas du tout de visibilité, on ne voit rien du tout. Mais bon, c'est pas grave, euh, pour la radio évidemment ça ne gêne pas <rire> énormément. Euh, mais en tout cas, euh, je te reçois très très fort Gérald, hein. vraiment très très fort là. 
euh, je sais pas où tu es en ce moment mais euh, bon moi évidemment là je suis donc euh, à la Madone euh, la Madone du Tel avec une Delta Loop hein, et euh, 50 watts ici donc euh, avec le VRM 5081 hein. Alright, coax goes around the bush and goes to the big transformer here with the FT240 core the wire goes up my 12 meter spider beam mast goes up over there to that tree in the middle and I have my 7 meter mast there so uh, it's a 40 meter wire and here's mountain weather for you changing rapidly and <laughs> it's getting really cold and uh, we can't see much of anything anymore and it's getting dark and so I will uh, probably use my K1 inside the tent on 80 meters I have my tent here the uh, ORC uh, combat shelter, uh, ICS, improved combat shelter, great tent, so you uh, can see the transformer here and my coax cable going inside, because I don't want the BNC to get wet. So we're going to have some coffee and uh, some uh, high proof uh, liqueur, just to stay warm. Whoops, almost walked on a cable here. Attention. <laughs> uh, here we are. So, some coffee. See my truck over there. <sighs> That's uh, field operations for you. <laughs> and here we're receiving uh, QO100, the uh, geostationary, geostationary satellite, which is situated above Qatar. with a homemade down converter going into an uh, FT817 So this is re receiving. So this is receiving Q100. Thirty-six thousand kilometers away. Down converted from uh, ten gigahertz. And all that without a computer. All right, guys, I'm inside my tent, waiting for uh, the atmosphere to uh, warm up a little bit. I have the uh, K1 set up on 80 meters, and uh, there seem to be a lot of people. Lots of condensation here. Very fast. Our contest down. And that explains the uh, high amount of traffic. Contest. Yeah, there's a big contest on 80 meters. Uh, it seems to be impossible to find a, an available, any available frequency. Not a single hertz available. Just gonna go a little faster. Test contest. Yep. Yeah. Well, guys, <laughs> it doesn't look like uh, I'm gonna be able to make any contact on 80 meters tonight because there's a contest. Good morning. <laughs> well, I slept pretty well. It's a little cold uh, at times, but... So I couldn't operate last night really uh, because of the contest. And of course this morning, <laughs> there's nobody on 80 meters. Nothing. You know what, I'm going to call anyway. You never know. 
j'entendais vachement bien c'est euh, l'oiseau. À chaque fois qu'il parlait, il y avait tout le <rire> oui, oui, tout le temps. Il ouais. parlait. C'est de voir qu'il y a encore la neige sur les tours. Allez, il y a un verre là euh, Ils sont tous occupés. Ils sont tous occupés faut mais bois ton rosé dit. déjà. Ton rosé, on, on le prendra après. Ah, c'est le rosé ça ouais. D'accord, merci. Ah, oh, bah c'est bon alors. I switched to the uh, Xigu G1M. 40 meters is booming. All European stations, of course. I don't speak any of those languages. <laughs> What else short? Ah, uh, well, it's one contact. Thank you very much. You are five and six here, five and six in the uh, south of France. Uh, we are uh, in the mountains, Portable as well, uh, about uh, 1100 meters altitude. Uh, back to you. Thank you very much. Uh, lots of QRM, uh, lots of QRM here. Uh, please uh, say your uh, QRZ again. Uh, QRZ again, this is Foxtrot 4. Whiskey, Bravo, Yankee, back to you. Done, that was hard. Uh, you heard me though, England. Okay, that was him, got him. Foxtrot 4, Whiskey, Bravo, Yankee. F4, whiskey, bravo, Yankee, QRP portable. QR 559, Thank you very much, I 5 by uh, 7 here, 5 by 7. I am on a summit, summit here in the south of France. Uh, QRP portable, QSL. Uh, can you give me your summit reference again? Oh, I only have the name, it's a uh, La Madonna, La Madonna Dutel. Uh, uniform Tango Echo Lima Lima Echo. I repeat, La Madonna La Madonna Dutel. Uh, uniform Tango Echo Lima Lima Echo. QSL? Yes, QSL, total reference. Uh, unfortunately, I did not activate with Sora. I did not activate in uh, with SOTA, I'm just on the summit here, uh, but uh, I'm not registered, uh, QSR? QSR, QSR, uh, call your activation, have a nice day, best and sleep. Thank you very much and uh, good luck with the activation, uh, have a great day. Foxtrot for Whiskey, Bravo, Yankee, over and out. You know, I never really registered, uh, actually I did register with SOTA, but uh, never activated a SOTA uh, summit officially. And maybe I should try that, uh, but I've never done it. So 
something to look into. I remember looking once at the website and I thought it was kind of complicated and I just gave up. But uh, yeah, yeah, I'm not against it. Maybe I'll try sometime. Uh, it was nice to uh, make a contact uh, QRP to QRP, submit to submit, that's for sure. <laughs> yeah. Time to go. <laughs> Nothing special really about this video, just a great time with friends, camping, beautiful view, um, mountain, you know, it's just, what can I say? What else do you want? You know, just a few contacts and uh, that's it. Um, we had a great time and uh, yeah, slept pretty well made a few contacts and explained the uh, radio to a lot of people actually there were a lot of people passing by and uh, so uh, asking questions and that was great because that's really something that uh, we need to do uh, as uh, amateur radio operator we need to uh, promote the activity and uh, we we all did plenty of that today and that's that's excellent so i didn't get to test i mean compare the uh, big turret the ft240-43 to the FT82-43, that's what I was planning to do, but you know, things just didn't turn out that way, and I ended up using the uh, the big FT240-43. Uh, didn't find a station to uh, uh, to have enough time to chat with to uh, switch uh, transformers. I really should have used Whisper, but I didn't want to get my computer out. It was very humid uh, last night. Everything was damp and uh, water, you know, droplets falling from everything. So I've extremely humid uh, uh, weather. So today would have been okay, but yeah, I just uh, didn't get to it. <laughs> That's it. So that'll be for another time, but I'll do it. I promise. All right. <laughs> Until next time, have a good one.